What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Shamar De John. Back again with another review on Kaiden Collective. You know, Big Ninja activities. Big Ninja in the building. So, if y'all remember that video I did on Kaiden Collective, like, maybe almost over a month ago. Well, no, I don't say over a month. About a month ago, I did a review on three shorts. It was the Koski Clouds, Toshi from Bleach, and Ichigo. It was a, a Bleach Ichigo one where he's hollow. But uh, yeah, I had ordered an additional three other shorts with that same purchase. Those shorts just came in today. So if you order from Kaiden Collective, purchase it and just forget that you ordered it because it, 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 it took a, almost, if not two months, a little over two months for the rest of these shorts to come in. So these came in before these are called the stream thunders you got zenitsu from demon slayer as you can see just dope and then on the back you got him again in like his calm state that came before these two so i got two other ones That's how the packaging comes It comes in like a small envelope. I'm not gonna show that because I have my address on it, but this is what it's wrapped in. And these are all a large. I'm five six, average five six. Biakua from Bleach, one of the captains. Probably the one of the best episodes of uh one of the most beginning fights of Bleach. If you've seen it before. Biakua, these are called the Bia or just B Y A in all caps together. That's what this model is called. So you got Biakua on the front right there, white strings, flip it to the back, just the design print. And then the last, this is a large shoe. All the shorts that I ordered in the large. It's probably my favorite. This is called the Flame Warrior. You got Ren Goku. Ren Goku is also from Demon Slayer. Just how the first one I held up, the Zenitsu one, the Stream Thunder. This one is called, um, this style shorts is called Flame Warrior. Size look with white strings. And we're going we gonna to get into these reviews. I'm going to get these on. I'm going to get a closer look for y'all too. So yeah, let's get the closer look for y'all. And then I'm going to get all three of these on. And by the way, please, I'm not trying to knock down my poster. These right here, these are the same shorts that I ordered with these three. I did a review on these. These are the Toshis. He's also, he's a captain from Bleach or whatever. So if you want to see a review on these shorts, I will put the card right here i think youtube usually places it to the top right so yeah i'm gonna put a card right there if you want to check that review out it's by kaiden collector too same brand but yeah let's get into these shorts all right y'all so the first shorts i'm gonna do for y'all is the flame warrior the ran gokus so you can see right there you got the kc for kaiden collective Just got a mixture and pattern, like almost like a flame, like a fire aura, just how he was in the anime, dashing through the train. I think it's called the Mongolian Train or something like that. It's a, uh, ep a series of episodes. The Demon Slayer arc is very, is like how they got it spread out is by arc. So you have to search the arc up, but he was mainly in that arc when it was on the train. Yeah, this fight is when he fought um, the upper three ranked demon, Akaza. So you can see right there, you got his sword. And you see the flames going around it. It's like a mesh material, just like regular gym shorts. Me personally, I would not wear this to the gym. I would wear this like on a hot summer day. You know, I'm in Alabama, so it get hot down. It ain't cold right now, but yeah. There you go, got Ran Goku, exactly from the fight. 
because one of his eyes got um, knocked out right there. Not knocked out, but he couldn't see out of his eye because of the blood. Got the hair, the fire hair for Ran Goku. And you got regular white strings. Just regular white strings. All right, let's get to the back side. So on the back side, I didn't even notice this mask right here. You got like a um, like a fox or cat mask or whatever. This is common in Japan. Yeah, that's cool. I'm just not noticing that. You got the fire. Stream clashing into the mask. That's dope. I'm really going to give y'all an interview. A lot of people, they make these videos. They just put the shorts on and hold them up. They don't really even give you a closer look at it. So I'm going to show you in really in much detail. You know, this is something you're going to pay money for. You're going to pay at least $40 per shirt. Uh, not shirt, but shorts. And you're going to have to wait probably max or probably over two months, especially with how the economy and all that stuff is set up. You're going to wait quite a minute for these shorts. So I want y'all to really look at it and, you know, you can decide if you want it or not. Let's get into the next one. All right. So next we got the Zenitsu's or the Stream Thunders. Got the KC for Kaiden Collective right there. These are probably um, my second favorites because I just like Rengoku that much. If not, they would be number one because of just the color. All of my videos, I edit them in Final Cut Pro X, so you're gonna see the true color. Like right now, through my phone, this look like a deep blue, but this is actually purple, like the main color right here. And you just seem like a stream of thunder mixed with his colors. Like this is cool. Got black. I like how they made these black or whatever. I wish that the tips had, I think, I wish they were rope, and I wish they had like the, the alkaloids on the, the tip of them. That would've been really cool. Yeah, as you know, Zenitsu, he's very playful, but this is his serious mode right here. He closed the eyes. No, it's real when he closed the eyes. Got the thunder coming out. All right, let's get into the back. All right, here we are with the back side. You got the chill, goofy, calm Zenitsu on the back. The scary Zenitsu, running away Zenitsu. Let's stretch that out so y'all can see it. Yeah, it's not much um, on the back or whatever besides that. I like how they put one simple thing on the back. Oh, yeah, and all of these have pockets. See the pocket right there. All right, let's get to the last one. All right, y'all, so lastly, we got the Biakua ones, the Captain from Bleach, or the BYAs, Bia. That's what these shorts are called on their site. So if you've seen Bleach the anime, you know Byakuwa, his um, Bankai, it's like, um, what is it called? I lived in Japan like for two years and I can't think of the name of it. Sakura uh, Cherry Blossoms. Yeah, like Cherry Blossoms. You know, his sword splits up into Cherry Blossoms or he can use it as a sword. Like, if you're watching Bleach, probably one of the most greatest fights, like, going into the anime, like, climax at the beginning. Got the KC for Kaiyan Collective at the bottom.
Got white strings up here. All right, let's get into the back. Okay, y'all, so there's not really too much on the back. The tip of his kimono right there that was on the front is, is um, going throughout the back, just at least on that side right there. I did find a defect in the shorts right here with the stitching. So look at this side right here. That's a bummer, man, especially for how long I waited. It takes too long. Now, I'm, I'm not going to knock them because I got five shorts and they were perfectly fine. These are my first pair that has like this error right here. I'm going to have to see how I'm going to fix this. But, yeah, that's pretty much it for the back. Now, let's get these on. All right, y'all, I'm going to apologize if you hear a baby in the background. That's my baby girl. She's with my wife right now. Sorry if you hear her. But, yeah, here are the BYAs or... B.I. or Biakua. So this is a large. I'm about 5'6", 175 pounds. That's how a large fit. That's how much room I have. This is a large. Like I said, I'm 5'6", um, 175 pounds. So I tied them. I just tied them. And... With the with the tied knot, that's how much room I got compared to the first one. Probably gonna get a medium next time. If you gonna rock these, make sure y'all hit leg day. Leg day is a must for these shorts. If you five six like me, you might wanna um a medium to small. All right, let's get to the next one. All right, y'all, so here we are with the Stream Thunders. Yeah, the Stream Thunders. The one was the Nisu. All of the shorts are large again, just to clarify to y'all. See, again, I'm five, six. 175. My legs are pretty small though. Yeah, these are like my top favorites right now. All right, those are the three stream thunders. I can't get my words in my mouth. Those are the stream thunders. Now on to the flame warriors. Lastly, we have the flame warrior with Ren Goku on there. As you see, there's my boy. Went out like an OG, man. Went out like a big ninja. Just want to reiterate, these are also a large... Five six one seventy five. If you are five six like me, you might want to get a medium or a small. Probably no further than the medium. Like if you exercise, weight training, I got more of a bulky type of build. So, yep. Those are the Flame Warriors. All right, y'all. That's the end of this video. To conclude, I will say this. These shorts, these Manjin Boo shorts that I got from Urban Sports Cultural. I did a review on these a while back ago. I'll put a card right here. I think YouTube let me add more than one card. Yeah, I'll put it right here. So you can check out the review on these shorts. Out of Kaiden Collective and Urban Sports Cultural. I love Kaiden Collective. I will continue to buy from them, but as far as top notch quality, Urban Sports Collective. I only have one pair of shorts and it's these Manja Boo shorts. Like I was saying before in the video, if they had, if Kaiden, if you do the rope 
strings like this and put like the metal tips at the bottom, you all, y'all, y'all would kill it. Like y'all would kill it, man. Um, and then even like this, zippers on the back, pockets, zipper pockets on the back, both sides. Very deep pockets, y'all will kill it. But for right now, it's only but one pair, but Urban Sports Culture, y'all got the win, man. Y'all got the dub right now. These are more expensive. These was $50 plus traditional shipping, so that totaled out for me to be $65. Now, these are gonna take over a month, probably two months to get to you. That's a lot of money, like I say. To, to spend and to not get your item immediately, but if you want top-notch quality or whatever as far as shorts, Urban Sports Cultural. But yeah, y'all, if you like this video, if you watch this video in its entirety, I appreciate it. If you didn't came this far, man, you ain't clicked off the video, you ain't then tapped throughout the video, like your attention, your attention was retained through the video, go ahead and hook your boy up with a subscribe, man. Hit that subscribe button, you know what I'm saying? Get a big ninja, um, you know what I'm saying, big ninja. Go ahead and give me a subscribe. Hit me up with a like, you feel me? Don't, not a lot of too many people do detailed reviews on anime shorts like this. A lot of people are hesitated, um, very, I can't get, I can't speak today, y'all, forgive me. A lot of people are very hesitant, just as myself, to buy these shorts for the price they are worth and how long it's telling me it's gonna get here. A lot of y'all are like that or whatever. And then when people do put reviews on this, they talk too much. They don't really get close up in on the shorts like that. So you can see the detail and the quality of the shorts. They don't really do none of that. So you know what I'm saying? If you rocking with this video, this review, hit the like button and go ahead and give your boys a, a subscribe. You feel me? But yeah, Big Ninja out. Peace.